What up, YouTube? It's your boy Chrome Dome here, coming at you live from a fairly decent Tuesday morning. Uh, you know, still on my disability uh, leave and everything. You know, I'm able to walk around. Doctor said I'm cool walking around now. But I was got to thinking, I'm getting bored. So I was like, you know what? Let's get a little productive today and uh, pull the Chevy out. You know? So, uh, I bought some, bought some lights, some headlights, because as you can see, that just, it's, it looks horrible, I mean, it's all brown and yellow, and just, it's done, it's done, it's done. So, I bought some nice clear ones, a while back, and, uh, we're gonna put them in today. So, I mean, I've already, uh, I haven't gotten too far in. I took out the two bolts, uh, right here, right there, and right there, but uh, I already ran into a problem. This bolt right here, and that bolt down there, they're not the same. I have a Phillips to take those first two out, and uh, <laughs> the other two are stars, so uh, come over to my handy dandy little doodad here with all my little pieces in it see if I can figure it out so let's get into this so first I gotta find out if I even have the size because if I don't it's gonna be a moot point and I'm gonna be done and just cussing and throwing a tantrum the whole time so well, it looks like I did boom suck me sideways that is awesome my phone So, I, uh, and this is the weekend after the fair, so that video will be up probably after this one, because today I'm thinking about doing two videos, uh, one for the headlights, maybe just one long video, I like these shorts, aren't they great? Um, one on the headlights. And I want to replace my my side mirrors because my side mirrors, they're uh, one's broken and they're really small. They were aftermarket like SS mirrors or something like that. So uh, guy put a piece of like of a some makeshift handheld mirror on the other side behind me. So. I uh, I just went ahead and bought some new uh, mirrors a while back, and uh, went that route. Man, I don't even know how you get these damn things up. So, there's one. The other. So I mean these are nice. You know, I'll probably keep these. Um because honestly I don't think I bought I think the, the kit might have come with new ones for what I bought. So got the uh got the grill apart. Um kinda wanna see what's in this thing because let me show you guys. Because I have a feeling it's going to be real dirty. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Not as bad as I thought. Oh, put the old grill away. Yeah, there's some, uh, some bugs and stuff that were living here. Maybe some rats. Take this little piece out. Ooh, there's the mess. That's what I was looking for. Okay, so show you guys what I'm working with here. So sorry guys. So I got a bunch, bunch, bunch of crap. 
It's all dirty. So basically now what I gotta do is I gotta take these these two bolts out and this whole assembly comes out. But I think before I do that, I think we're gonna clean it a little bit. Yeah, we're gonna clean it. I don't really recommend this in your garage. And uh, I don't have an air compressor, so I'd use air to clean it out, but ain't gonna happen. So in my garage, I don't really recommend it, but I'm gonna do it because it's already hot outside. I'm a big guy, obviously I sweat. Um, there's some good looking teachers at this school. Office staff and everything, damn. <laughs> um, so, yeah, let's clean it out and see what we find. Cause, so like I said, I'd like to uh, make a few other videos. Well, obviously that ain't gonna work because I gotta find a an actual wrench to fit it. Oh, lucky me, I already have it here. It's nice. Um, I can make a few other like install videos about. Let's see, I've got. Oh, oh, what's that? Oh, oh, that guy, that guy right there. Oh, you know, just a. Uh, well, Bill 350 that I bought from a buddy. See, my thing is, is I would like a supercharged small block. Now, a lot of people are like, Kyle, Kyle, what are you doing? Oh, you're wasting your money uh, doing uh, this build. You know what? That may be the truth, but LSs are just so common. I want to do something different. I honestly thought about putting a uh, 2JZ in it, which, if any car enthusiasts are out there, know that a 2JZ is a Japanese motor, and I would piss everybody off. Guess what? I really don't care if I piss anybody off. It's my truck! Found my extension. And yes, I have a 10 millimeter. Oh, I didn't lose it yet. Keyword, yet. So like I said, I wanted to do a 2JZ, honestly. Single turbo, big old turbo on a 2JZ in an American car? Like, you really only do a swap I get to piss people off. Like I said, not really here to make friends. I'm just here to do what I want. And, uh, you know, I was looking at funds and... It would be cheaper to build a cam heads, nice little uh, LS motor. Apparently, it would take about half the money from what I see. Um, like I said, I really don't want to do an LS. I just, and I'm not bagging on the LS, but everybody does them. And I'm not everybody. I want to be different. So, I decided, my buddy, who was going to the army, I bought a couple things from him, um, and he mentioned, he's like, you know, you're trying to do a build, because at first I was going to build the throttle body motor in here. That's wasting my time. I want 400 horsepower. Now, stock, these things come like 190s, low 200s, if you're lucky. Just a 5.7, 350. And I really don't want to do that. It just, that even that would be a waste of time. So what I said was, well, what do you got? And he goes, well, obviously I've got my, my big block. And I'm like, oh, a big block in this? Oh yeah, he wanted way too much. <laughs> so I told him, I said, well, what about that little motor you got back there? And he said, oh, it's just a little 350 I built. I said, you know what? You're going away to the army and I really support military, so why not for a good cause? 
So we ended up giving him, I think, he, and he gave me a deal. I think we paid 600 bucks for a complete motor, all the accessories and everything in a box, which is in the back of my truck. Um, this is also a storage unit, by the way. <laughs> so, the, uh, it's, it's, it's stroke to a 355, or not stroke, board, sorry. Um, stroke to, damn it. It's a 355. And it's, uh, it's just going to have a nice little carb, um, intake, nice little air cleaner, you know, dress up a little bit. I'd like to keep the AC on it because, I mean, I'm a big guy, I need AC. Um, but if I don't have AC, I don't have AC, whatever. So we bought that and some accessories. And right now I just need to go smog the truck first and get that done. And once I get that done, we can dig into it, turn the motor out and, uh, go from there. So, like I said, end goal would be a supercharged, like an old late weigh-in, weigh -in. I don't know, somebody correct me out there, I don't know exactly how to say it, um, just a nice old blower. Now, my dad knows a guy who builds the motors for uh, NJBA boats, like jet boats, top fuel hydros, and... Uh, can't really rely on him a lot because he's busy and he's doing his own thing. But I mean, if I get that guy, he said he's got a bunch of motors. I get that guy to at least get me a real nice built small block, like 383 or something like that. Oh, game over, boys and girls. It would be over 400 horsepower. Plus, he's got the hookups for all those performance parts. So, yeah, those are my goals. End goal is a supercharged 350. Not a big fan of turbos. They're probably easier, honestly. Not nagging on turbos, saying they're horrible. But I like the whine of a supercharger. It would be, uh, it'd be pretty awesome. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish this up because I keep taking too many breaks in this video. Well, guys, here's the progress I made. Definitely a big difference from that and that. Pretty gross, huh? Turns out these have bul uh, bulbs in them already, so it's pretty exciting. And I didn't know this when I bought the kit, but these sard markers right here, I got them in clear. So I'm going to shove those in, and then I got these bad boys to go under uh, to replace... Those guys down on the bottom. So, yeah, this is going to be a little different. So, I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, it was a uh, super hot. Um, I changed my shirt. I sweat so bad. Um, about an hour later, and I uh, got it all done. Actually, it looks really good. I'm surprised how uh, how well this looks. Um, I'm sure. And here's the finished product. Clear corners, clear turn signals, clear headlights. What do you think, Mr. Mason? Daddy. Yes, sir. Daddy did it. Looks good. With that being said, if you like what you guys are seeing, comment, subscribe, like, dislike. Like I said, uh, really don't care. Just would like some feedback, even if it's bad feedback. Um, tell me what you want to see. Tell me, you know, how I can improve. Um, let me know. You know, we got you guys are a part of this with me, and we got some big plans for old uh, whatever green green bean. Probably what this thing's gonna be called. I don't know. It's another thing. If you guys got a name for it, probably gonna stay green. If you got a name for it, let me know. 
Hit me up. Tell me what you think. So, yeah, like I said, come along with me for the adventures, guys. We'll talk to you later. Peace.